So I think probably one of the most powerful experiences was um, going to Vancouver on a site visit and being in a room with uh, survivors of sex trafficking as well as some of our own task force members. And it took one split moment for two people, the police officer on our task force, as well as one of the survivors to see each other and to recognize that he was the one that had saved her. And they both got up and gave a big hug to each other. And it was one of those moments where you just wanted to burst into tears because you realized that that had happened quite a long time ago and here she was still working her way through the damage that had been inflicted upon her, but that the humanity between the two of them was still um, really on the edge and that they, uh, they had both given each other something, an experience that had altered their lives as well. We need to get involved and we all need to get involved. This is a stain on our country and it's a stain on our democracy. We like to think of ourselves in Canada as peace-loving, peaceful, kind, generous of spirit. And we are for the most part. But as long as there is one girl being trafficked inside our country, then we cannot ignore that. These women, their stories take up residence in your heart. And they will never, they will never be gone from us. Um, and we owe it to them.